Good Monday morning and welcome to our Monday message. Don't forget that you can share this with someone. I pray it gets your week started off right. Here's the message from Matthew 2 that tells of the significance of the wise man, wise men to, uh, to see Jesus and how their visit reminded us of the fulfillment of prophecy, beginning with verse 1. After Jesus was born in Bethlehem in Judea, during the time of King Herod, Magi from the east came to Jerusalem and asked, Where is the one who has been born King of the Jews? We saw his star in the east and have come to worship him. When King Herod heard this, he was disturbed and all Jerusalem with him. When he had called together all the people's chief priests and teachers of the law, he asked them where the Christ was to be born. In Bethlehem of Judea, they replied, for this is what the prophet has written. But you, Bethlehem, in the land of Judah, are by no means least among the rulers of Judah. For out of you will come a ruler who will be the shepherd of my people, Israel. This is a song called One Small Child that talks about the significance of this prophecy being fulfilled and who Jesus was and is. One small child in the land of a thousand One small dream of a Savior tonight one small hand reaching out to the starlight. One small city of light. One king bringing his gold and his riches. One king ruling an army of might. One king kneeling with incense and candlelight, one king bringing us light. Oh, oh, oh. see him lying a cradle beneath him, see him smiling in the storm. See his mother praising his father. See his tiny eyelids fall. One small light from the flame of a candle. One small light from a city of mine. One small light from the stars in the endless light, one small light from a face. Oh, see the shepherds kneeling before him, see the kings on them. See his mother praising his father. See the blessed and sleep. One small child in a land of a thousand. One small dream in the people of mine. One small hand reaching out to the starlight. One small Savior of life. Oh, oh, oh. Mm -hmm. God, our Father, thank you for Jesus. It's hard to imagine how that baby lying in the manger, who was as your word and John reminds us that he was with you in creation. We give you thanks for the mystery of this child who gave his life an atonement for our sins. Bless us with 
renewed meaning during this season and who you are to us and who you would be to those who should come to know you as Savior. I pray in Christ's name.